Oh, ears, ears, ears. What do I have to do with any of that? Gosh, you guys are so predictable. I can't even take a nap without somebody getting stupid. Uh, for some reason, you seem to believe that I am a part of it or anybody else. Or you're really just trying to milk this thing for your attention. I've seen you make seven, eight videos based on the same conversation you had with Kwame. I haven't said anything since the night it actually happened and we were all on there and I spoke to you. I really have got nothing to say about it, really. It's done and done. I'm surprised that you dragged it out this long. Should have been 15 minutes tops and moved on. But you don't want to move on because I guess this is... What you want, some attention and content, I, I guess, I don't know. But to say I'm a yes man and all this, where you getting this from? <laughs> I made clear and concise reasons as to what happened and why you should have shut the f up. Because <laughs> you didn't know what you was talking about. You agreed you didn't know what you was talking about. But me, a yes man? When you say you your whole channel is a Kwame Brown support channel. That came out your mouth, man. So your channel is predicated on that. My channel, I'm, I was already 200,000 subscribers before I ran into Kwame Brown. So this is like where we are right now. Because I'm not a yes man. If I was a yes man, I'd have took the 1.7 deal. I'd be living a lot larger and not happy with myself because I wouldn't be me. I'd have let them delete all those videos off my channel and tell me what videos I should put out or what they think is acceptable and be controlled and have an apple in my mouth. If I was a yes man... But because I'm a hell no man. I move by the beat of my own drum. Because I'm a hell no man. I can move freely. Do what I want freely. And as you can see. I'm okay with that. Now. I've never had any problems with you. I don't make no videos dissing you and nothing like that or saying nothing about you. So my thing is, you're taking the same route Gummy did. You ran right over to Tommy and started doing, letting Tommy up and start going over to Tommy. He ain't showing no loyalty to me. So why I got to show loyalty? <laughs> See, this is why <laughs> I could never, ever, ever, ever be associated with you on no way, shape, or form. Your attitude shows a lack of moral compass. If you weren't speaking to Tommy just because of Kwame, that showed that you really wanted to talk to them people. You really want to be over there. So if you really want to be over there, then go over there. Because you said, use a man, right? You said it about a hundred times. That use a man. So use a man. <laughs> so go ahead and be a man. Stand on what you say and move on. You ran your mouth about something you didn't know about. That's fine. Everybody makes their mistakes. Even in the video, at the end, you said, I should have just shut the up. Yep. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> you said, I said, I was telling him, I understand. 
I understand what you're saying, and then I was going to get on. But you didn't understand what he was saying. <laughs> that's, that's the point you keep missing. You keep, no, no, but I ain't saying I'm all that. I'm just trying to like move on. You know, that why he, why he was shooting. I was saying, I understand what he was saying. So the reason that he was trying to see shooting, see, I was understanding what he was saying. Like, I hear you. I hear what he's saying. Now, I hear what I'm coming with. <laughs> But you don't understand what he said. Because <laughs> what he said didn't make any sense. He was shooting because he wanted to shoot. He was going to shoot. That's just all in his nature. To shoot, 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 shoot. So as people start complaining about it, then he going to pout and act like, all right, well, y'all do all the shooting then. I don't care. Y'all shoot. I, I, I'm going to just sit here. I'm going to pass y'all the ball. <laughs> so that was his reason. He just wanted to make up something to keep something going on. But, hey, whatever sells it, man, because, you know, you're a man. You're a man. Since you're a man, I spoke to you as a man. I was on Kwame platform the whole time, and I was listening. And when I came up there, I tried to speak to you. To get you to understand and hear what was happening. I went back and listened to it. Then I said, okay, I see where y'all points are. Now, when he said she was acting like a B word, I said, hey, I feel that's a little too strong. Because I would have never said that to anybody. Even a female. So I disagreed that, <laughs> that he should have said that to you. But... You kind of was acting like that. And not like, you know. So your actions validated the point that he said that. You validated with all the things that you've been doing in your activity. Everything that you've done since then has exuberated. Something less of a man. But I'm not going to take that away from you. Because, without a doubt. He's a man. Do you or do you not recognize this a man standing here? Yeah, I know he's a man. So everyone gets it. Okay? We all know. You are a man. Now, act like one. I'm out.